Hey man, where that other dude? The dude that creeped on that dude. Michael, this creeping days are done. Well, what you mean? He stopped creeping? No more creeping for him. He like retired from from creeping. From everything. That's funny, cause like the boy Frank didn't mention shit about that. And as a matter of fact, I don't even know the dude. But considering the mutual acquaintances we got, I would have liked an invite to the retirement party. There weren't no party. No party? I used the term retirement euphemistically. Homie, for a dude that kills dudes and eats dudes and fuck dudes, you talk fruity. It's unconfirmed. What's unconfirmed? The fact that you talk stupid or the fact that you do some messed up shit? Or where the other dudes at? Like... Maybe he's dead. The last one. Oh shit, man. Fuck. Do Frank know about this? I don't know if Franklin knows, but let's just let him sleep. You unhooked it, man. We ain't leaving them whips. The boss man ain't gonna like it if we leave them whips behind, man. Get them back on. Come on, man! Jesus! Alright, we good, you old clumsy motherfucker. Man, it's a good thing I told your dumb ass about that shit. Fuck, man, he fucked you. The fucker got fucked. Damn. He fucked the fucker himself. You unhooked the trailer. Hook it back up. All right, we good, you old clumsy motherfucker. Man, it's a good thing I told your dumb ass about that shit. It's a lonely old road, ain't it? Lonely? Hey, I couldn't say. I mean, not really. A road's a road. It ain't got abandonment issues. Truckers on the blacktop making do? I don't need to make do. I need to make snaps on these rods. Sure. Yeah, the time will come. It's what happens before we get paid is what? Franklin's asleep. It's just me and you. What? What you trying to say? You want me to jack you off or something? Jesus, no. God, no. Of course not. Unless Man, you's a sick fiend! Just fiend? Then for some friendship. Friendship? Right, whatever, man. It's just... Truckers are a symbol of this country. No part of its mythology like cowboys, gangsters, hobos. Gang bangers. Truckers are about the unsexiest myth I ever heard. Apart from hobos. Uh, maybe tired with hobos. Freedom. Loners in the night. You know what truckers do? Cut up women and get other dudes to jack them off. Come to think about it, aside from not lugging freight around the country, you got about all the necessary prerequisites for a fine career in haulage. No shame in that. If you don't want to get paid or enjoy human contact. Money's bullshit. So is friendship. All right, all right, all right. I see you still touching. How's Franklin doing over there? Aw, uh, dude getting paid to sleep. Don't even worry about him. Ah, uh, the sleep of innocence. So he, like, in charge on this one? You work for him? He's a kind of figurehead. A puppet, if you like. With Devin Weston's hand up his ass. Right up to the elbow. That dude, real shame. Ooh, it's repulsive, but... Well, once he's paid us, he can be whatever we want him to be. 
what you want him to be. I want him to be someone who understands that all the money in the world can't save him from a nasty guy who thinks he's an asshole. Now that's something I want to see. So, uh, tell me, man, how y'all end up meet? Michael introduced us. Me and Frank didn't exactly travel in similar circles. Nah, I mean the creeper. Michael? Ha! <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah, you know. Sorry, but I don't want to reminisce. The wounds ain't healed. You such a delicate man to be attention. Where your pussy at? What you got in there? Screw you! That's good. Let it out, homie. Go on, let it out. Vent. The turd was probably playing me from the start. Right, yeah. Probably. How you do it? Where? When? All right. All right! Fuck! I was running a small air freight outfit in North Yankton. A tiny operation. There's one beagle I could borrow when I needed it. We were kids. Oh it's shit, what's that? Wake up, you dozy motherfucker! Team. One time was on a ride! This is what happens when you fall asleep on the job. What you gonna do? Okay, shit! I got an idea! Keep driving! I'm gonna take the tricked out JB700 and get rid of the tail! Devin's lawyer said there'd be some new hardware on board. Hey, don't forget the headset, homie. We have reason to believe you were transporting stolen vehicles. Pull over to the side of the road. They must have waited till we was out of town. Yeah, it looks like it, don't it? You said the coast was clear when you boosted it, Lamar.
Clinton, where are you? We're coming up to GOA. Man, the cops was all over us. They slowed us down some. That's not surprising. The insurance companies have been pressurizing them to find you since the studio break-in. You knew there'd be heat? Man, you could have told us. Don't get emotional. We're waiting at Procopio Truck Stop. Be here soon. We're taking the rides to the truck stop at Procopio. I'm gonna speak to the legal counsel woman. Get us paid. Yeah, I heard about that CEO pay shit. Just make sure it's fair salary for the workforce, motherfucker. Yeah, what he said. You taking care of. Head back to town. Hello, Franklin. Yeah, where Devin at? Somewhere meditating or ripping somebody off? In light of the drama your efforts caused, we felt it was not perhaps the best idea for you two to be seen together for a while. Where's the money? Mr. Weston is one of the most brilliant investors the world has ever known. He's... obviously a maverick, but he's also rigorous in his research. Yeah, he may be brilliant. Look, let me be the first to tell you. He ain't gonna fall in love with your ass. Now, where the fuck is my money? The best thing that could have happened to you in this situation has happened. He is going to hold your money, invest it in his Alpha Fund, and make the funds available to you at a time as the transfer will not induce any undue attention. Which is a polite way of saying I'm getting robbed? Are you fucking kidding me? That is a short-sighted and frankly immature way of seeing things, Mr. Clinton. Let's go. I boost cars and pop motherfuckers. Maturity is not really my fucking thing. 